Greetings, and welcome back to another Let's Play. I'm continuing my Amnesia the Dark Descent play, and as we last left off, we came into the, uh, I guess, left the entrance hall. This door just kind of exploded. Uh, I changed my mouse sensitivity a little bit, so now I should be able to click and move things a lot easier than I could before. Alright, let's see. NOTE! 16th of May, 1839. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. Glory for Britain. All right, anyway. Nothing in there. Roach. Fucking roaches. No. Yeah, I'm gonna crush the roach. Give me the fucking book. Wait, where'd he go? There. Bam. Err. Dang it! Did, did, did I actually? You son of a! You know, that all right, I'm out of here. I'm not gonna mess with that roach anymore. He's too powerful for me. Let's open the door. hereby offer my full attention and services to Alexander, Baron of Brennenberg. This contract reigns a total of three years when my freedom shall return to me. In addition, Alexander, Baron of Brennenberg, I swear I, I can read it. Just, just, just don't judge me. <laughs> is to recommend my services at the Prussian Parisian? Parisian royal court within the sanctum of the Order of the Black Eagle. No man, may no man break this seal. Wilhelm, House of Garrick. 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 Signal light though tender. Get out of here, chair. Just toss the chairs everywhere. I swear I'm going to get these controls down. It's just going to take a little bit. Probably a lot of dying. It came in from there. Oh yeah, I got a lean function! I forgot about that! That's going to help me a lot. Catalogs. Yeah! There's no reason, just... Very creepy. I'm sitting in my room, uh, or not my room. I'm sitting in my living room by myself. My 5.1 system going on. The only thing I got is this headset to keep me calm. It's completely dark in here. I have the feeling one of my cats going to try to scare the shit out of me at some point, but anyway. That would be 17th of May, 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need. To document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. 
The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Huh. Interesting. Oh, and before I forget to tell you guys, uh, this Let's Play of uh, Amnesia, I'm going to increase to 20 minutes because I really am enjoying this game. And it's purely for my own enjoyment. If you guys don't like it, oh god. Well, I did kind of break that, but why would I be here? Okay, sanity coming. But I'm increasing this to 20 minutes because I want to play this game some more. I say 20 minutes, more than likely it's going to be like 25 or something like that. But either way, I want to get through this game. Oh crap, I think I ran out of lantern oil. Uh, let's tender that. Open you. I think I said open. that put you back up because that's that's where you were before and I liked you there. Alright, let's see what's down here. Probably my death. Or something close to the like. I haven't seen any closets in here to hide. I guess what I can do is hope I don't have to hide anytime soon. Got some creepy crawlies in here that want to knob at my nasties. Ugh. I heard that. Can't tell me I didn't hear that. The fuck was that? Boy. Big castle like mansion in the mist. Oh boy. That, 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 that is. Blood. That's definitely blood. That's a lot of blood. And it's still dripping, so I wonder what the fuck was up there. Hmm. Got some stuff over here. Lantern oil. Oh boy. I am not liking where this. I'm not. I'm, I'm definitely not liking where this. Going back now. Guess I can only continue forward. I swear I will get faster at this, I promise. 
Please don't unsubscribe because I suck at playing this part of the game. Oh no. Oh god. What the fuck is going on? The hell? 17th of May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself yes, drawn to the mystic light. I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. Geometry, the next awesome. thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. And grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. Alright, well apparently he got probed and just didn't know it. At least that's what I'm coming is good. Head is pounding and hands are shaking. But I'm standing near light. But now, okay, head is pounding, hands are shaking. I guess I, I guess that's a, I guess that's the norm for this guy. Let's just shut that door. Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives. It won't take long until things start falling apart. They're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Apparently they know about the shadow coming, and, uh, yeah. Okay, well, I've been this way, I've been through that way, can't go back that way, I've got a chair. Problem with playing a new game. You don't know where you're supposed to go. Let's come back out here again. And, uh, I'm not breaking my hand. I'm going to grab that chair. Somebody out there is watching, going, oh, he, you know, he walked right by right here. It's probably right there. You know, just grab it and stop wasting all of our time, Sean. God, I'm mocking myself a lot today. Let's see. Uh, I got a book. More parchments.
slap my ass and call me Sally. Definitely got me through where I wanted to be. You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, then. Oh boy. I hope I'm not get I hope I'm not gonna get chased by ghoulies when one of those story moments are going on, because that would be really, really stupid. Alistad, Altstad, did, 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 and Brennenberg Castle, 1801. Another region with rich lore, Alistad Castle, Alistad deep within the East Perserian, Per, Perserian, Perserian, You know, I'll have to watch the Let's Play just to see what the fuck that says. You'll just have to give me the P Woods. For centuries, there have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighbor. Castle Brennenberg, a quiet forest-clad mountain, dr mountains dressed with scattered lakes, is as picturesque as it can be, Al albeit the area is haunted by dark, by the dark. Ask any local, and you will hear proof of the widespread superstition. All travelers should indulge themselves in such conversations, since it will certainly serve as an exciting entertainment. All of them have their own twists. On on the tales, but there are some motifs that keep reappearing. The gatherers. Oh god. Okay. Well, uh, as much as I want to read this, I think that's going to take way too much time. So here's what I'm going to do. I'll give you five seconds. Five seconds. And five seconds. Alrighty. And if you want to read all that, you can go ahead and uh, pause the video and read through that yourselves. For now, I'm going to continue on. Cause of it. Oh, it's locked. about exploration.
door got banged open, I'm going to just go ahead and look through this real quickly. Grab the note. One, two, three, four, five. And I'll probably read these later when I upload it. I, like to, I watch my own videos just to make sure. I watch my own videos before I upload them just to make sure they're all nice and sound. But, alrighty. I think that's a good place to end it, just as the ghoulies are about to grab at my nards. Alrighty. Um, yeah, there wasn't much to this one. Um, the atmosphere is nice, and being here in the dark while this is all going on, I, I, I can't explain it. You gotta do it yourself. I, I, I'd like a good pair of headphones to do this one of these days, and I can just imagine how it would get my heart going, because I already had a couple of uh, ooh, moments doing this. Can't exactly see, but you know, if I get a webcam, you'll be able to see all the, all the scary faces, or yeah, scary faces that I make. Cause you know, God knows, no one wants to see what the fuck I look like when I make a scary face. Oh. Anyway, I thank you all for watching. Like, share, subscribe, promote me, favorite. You know, help help me grow, help the audience grow, and uh, again, it, it will justify me buying better equipment for doing these let's plays for you. For now, I still do them for fun. I'm probably still going to continue to do them for them, whether I get an audience or not. And, again, thank you all for watching. And I will see you all in my next play. Peace.